Okay, I don't know if we can go up here. I don't see any other stuff. Like, I don't see any icons here, so I'm just gonna vacate this area for now, and maybe we'll... Uh, I, I know the thing I said about not doing... <laughs> we should come here. Let's go back to Anurjunan. Yeah, let's rest a little bit. Maybe we'll get access to new places. The others left to explore town. Okay. Well, I'm not really here for much exploring. I just wanna get some rest. Well-deserved rest. Wouldn't you agree? Brittle houses in the city. Have you met Priscilla? Oil. Hey, you see that? Dave's Chocobo Express! Oh! Nice. They have a stop here, too. The, the inn. The inn. Not every day we've been many, on this. Been an age since we yes, the staff's back. Hello there. Room for one. What? Anybody, please! Yes? That sword. You're some kind of fighter, aren't you? That was Priscilla. Help! And from the sound Somebody of it, she needs a tough guy like Help! you to lend a hand. Priscilla? They say we'll know her once we see her. We gotta go! Now! There's a monster attacking the boat! Ocean's this way! Down here! <laughs> yeah, the ocean's real quiet. Quickly, oh, I've never been down here. Help! Oh! Hey, girl! Somebody! Anybody! Help! What's in the water? Can you swim? Wait, this is a, what? Go away! I taste terrible. It's a bird fish. Oh. Yuffie, grab his fin and hold on tight. Friends, fish friends. Wanted. Get rid of that thing. Say what? Ferret, focus. No one's being discreet about this. They're just yelling out loud. Hey, avalanche! Get its attention. <laughs> On it. What is it? Oh, the docks are going. I'm sorry, but they're gone. You look pretty. Wow, damn, I came back. I thought we were gonna rest at the end. I don't even have full health, you kidding me? <gasps> Dude! Let's go! I need to assess you first. You need to let me assess you. Terror of the deep. Allow me. Thunder, a monstrous aquatic creature that lives off the coast of Junon. It possesses a buoyancy that allows it to swim at high speeds through both the water and air. Swim in the air. <laughs> it ingests seawater and then expels with explosive force to stun prey. Inflicting enough damage on its head while it's in the water will pressure it and cause it to take to the air. Attacking the water cells it creates will pop them. So we can only pressure it when it's in the water, which it currently isn't. Okay. Take the lead. Take over. Guess it's my turn. Oh man. Tailfin? An opportunity right here. We're crippled it already. Bring it home. Let's do this. Now. That's pretty good. Get ready. Can I pressure you with focus thrust though? Because you're sort of in the air right now. I kinda doubt that. I'm gonna get you to heal yourself. Keep it together. Red. Gotcha. I don't know if Red can even do any aerial combat. I have to investigate. Whoa, whoa! Barret is inside the little bubble. 
Shit. Oh, we need better off with magic. Magic? I need ATB. Damn it. Oh my god. Ready when you are. Water salt. A thick global regurgitated by the terror of the deep. I'm assuming it's thunder. Wait, if it's thunder, it won't. I don't know. I can't assess it because Cloud's busy. I'm just gonna poison it. Suffer. <laughs> Neither Fang nor Claw will suffice. You ready? Yeah. Sorry, Barrett. That was not good. All the times. Yeah, I really need y'all to. I don't have thunder. I want to cure myself just in case. Oh, that just wasted the ATB. Gotta be careful. We need Barrett for this. Because he's the only one with a thunder. Oh, Thundara! Goodness. Shit. Better off with magic. You kidding me? Oh my god! Don't worry. Damn it. Red has no spells. I can't do this. I can't. Wind. Fire probably isn't gonna work on the water. Oh! Wind! Neither Fang nor Claw will suffice. I think wind would have worked. Except Cloud's dead. So that's great. Phoenix draft? This probably would have been easier if I had the right materia, but I. unfortunately don't. Let's keep it down. Of all the times. Finally, goodness. Take this. Is anybody else helping? I I feel like I need to heal. I'm gonna take a chance though. And I don't know if I need to assess the water salt. I'm gonna heal. Take it from here. Oh, yeah. and... What now? <laughs> the water cell is weak against wind, it's though. Below us. For sure. Not looking good. Cloud, did you heal? Wait, Cloud didn't get the heal. Are you kidding me? Seriously? Stay calm now. It's in the water. Is that Siphon Fang doing anything? Keep it together. All right, watch and learn. We could summon. Oh, Rama. Now this is a fun. I kind of want to assess the water salt. <laughs> It's so crazy though, every time it does a water cell plus and then it takes Cloud who has my assess materia, so that doesn't work out too well for me. Oh! Shit. Better off with magic. No, I'm sorry, I have to assess it. Too bad. I have to assess it. <laughs> so any kind of magic. Ah, oh, it's not wind. Any kind of magic is okay. Except for bio, maybe. Yeah, I don't think bio really works here. Wind current? Maybe? That's that. Okay, at least we got that over with. I really need you to just be a little bit. Okay, I'm just gonna. Don't overdo it. I want Cloud to be healed up. I'm kind of worried about him. Oh, Red, I'm sorry. Need my help, do you? Everyone. Okay. No, not that. Not again. Is someone water? Is red okay? Deal with that. Red avoided the water saw. Overfang raises limit levels. Partition overfang. Just do overfang. 
Should really be using Rama skills, I think. Now's our chance. Oh, come on. Come on, buddy. Second wind. Fine. Thank you. Don't stop now. It's over. I have it. That got a little hectic. Oh no, you don't. I don't think the water cell counted as an enemy, but gotta assess them all. Wow, your hair is still perfect. Nice work. Let's check on that girl. Come on. I don't think she's breathing. Hey, we need help over here. I think this battle showed that Red needs some other elemental materia too. Uh, she's so cold. Somebody help! You want to bring me back, Dolphin? Oh, I need to get her breathing again. Y'all waiting for me to get here? No, I can't do anything. Maybe someone should go find a doctor? There's no time. Somebody! Help! Oh. <sighs> Don't just stand there. Help me. You're on chest compressions. Got it. <sighs> now, start. Uh. Uh, you're saving a life. You're saving. A oh God! <laughs> She's okay. You picked the wrong girl, creep. What? <gasps> but does she recognize Avalanche? Oh yes. Those guys there are from the Splinter Cell. Splinter Cell? They used to be with Avalanche, but left after a policy dispute. Because they didn't want to work with Wutai? Easy. They're guests of mine. And this one was trying to save your life. He was? Ugh, nice going, Yuffie. Call the guy a creep, why don't ya? You big moron! Dum 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 dum! <laughs> you seem perfectly fine. Okay, Yuffie. Let's get you inside. You've had a rough day. Yeah. All right. Thank you very much. You're welcome. <laughs> Not to beat that guy, but kids these days, I swear. Now, now. You are that guy. <laughs> Who's that? Another one of my guests. I seem to get a lot of them when the world's on fire. She didn't immediately come and say, hey, you're Avalanche yet. Well, it's not something you really should be talking about in public, I guess. Uh. Everyone in the beach is gonna awkwardly stare at me? Okay, maybe we should leave. Monsters like that one have been cropping up more and more lately. Goddamn reactors to blame. Thanks again. She would have been in deep shit without you. Monsters like that one have Does been she want to talk? Lately. Before I forget, I do want to add some to Red's materia. Clearly, that situation he could have done with a little bit more, I think. Oh, we got the bangle stuff. Oh, yeah, yeah, he's got to have a better bangle. What? He's been sitting on this random. I feel like I want to prioritize materia over the stats. Yeah, I didn't change it because I was looking at the stats last time. That's right. You want the Queen's Guard? Bangle? Yeah. Get some nice stuff going on here. At the minimum, you need what? I don't know, give you a fire materia, something. You need something. Auto casting? Forget about auto casting. Lightning, sure. Lightning, poison, fire. 
goddamn reactors to blame. Port of Under Junon. Actually, haven't looked around here. Maybe I'll have a quick look. Just one little nibble, and I'd hook him quicker than a minnow can swim a dipper. Oh, there's a Queen's Blood person here. Okay. Oh, well, would you look at that? I finally hooked a catch, and a good one, too. Bet you hitting you on me? You could blow me out of the water just because I'm getting on in years, hmm? Well, think again. I'm this town's ace angler, Zogan. And I've caught much bigger QB fish than you, Sonny. I tell you that much. You young'uns can thrash all you like, but you'll never beat my years of experience. Let's go. Sorry, Yuffie, give me a sec here, all right? I think I'm gonna... I don't... I'm not much for different decks. I'm just gonna maybe spend a little bit of time. Cat tour. I think we should get some level threes, though, because getting level... Shiva. What does Shiva do again? So many things I want to... Yeah, I don't know what spawn diamond dust means. I guess we can find out together. He. If I can figure out how to freaking move something else away. Queen B. The Devil Rider? I don't even know when we got the Devil Rider. Maybe it's from a card pack. S the, the number is really high. Four. That's nice. Ah, uh, okay. Change little bits. Little bits at a time. I think we're good. Easy start with the Sentinel, and then we can do Chocobo and Moogle. I always start in the middle lane. Maybe I should be changing up my strategies or something. Oh no! Shiva! Okay, what does spawning diamond dust mean? I'm gonna save you, maybe? Now we have a bit of a problem, don't we? They kind of took over the spot right in the middle there. I can take this lane. I can give up on the middle lane, basically. Oh my god, whoa, they're really pressuring me. I'm just gonna try and see what this diamond dust thing does. Oh! Oh, that's terrible! That's terrible, I'm done! I just blocked myself with Shiva, you kidding me? Oh, wow, that... Okay. I mean, I can't do anything else! <laughs> wow, Shiva, thanks! Thanks, Shiva. You're a lifesaver. I think we might win the first lane. The... Oh, the diamond dust can be either four or two. It could be a tie changer, but as it stands right now, I'm pretty sure we're losing everything. <laughs> hey, we actually got the bottom lane. So that's a very situational kind of thing then. And we definitely don't want to be putting Shiva down in the beginning. More like uh, the end kind of thing. Damn, that was terrible. Okay, I changed my deck up a little bit, and I got a Cactuar as well. Is this gonna be okay? Probably... Uh, Shiva... We need more level 1s for now. Yeah... Simple level 1s would be good. So the Cactuar here, it'll affect a strange... Plus three on that one. That's an interesting tile to affect. I'm gonna leave it alone for now because they can't... They can't come over there anyway. We need to keep advancing. Plus three. The Cactuar is pretty damn great. Okay. Okay, this is... This is interesting. They're kind of far away from that one on the bottom. They can't get it yet, so I'm gonna leave it alone. And what I'll do is... 
plus two on that? Wait, that spot right now, I can't even access it, can I? Yeah, I can only access it after I get this. I put a little green thing on it. Now you're trying to steal it from me? Not on my watch. I need something that extends a little bit further out. They've taken a lot of slots, I don't have the right cards. Yeah, but I can increase my number by quite a bit here. Okay, we might be okay, I'm looking at the numbers here. We probably have the bottom row, without putting any more cards down. And then the top row, the middle row we've lost. The top row, we can win. Yes. We won. Can we even put Shiva down and see what happens? You can have the middle row for all you want. Oh, no, 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 no. No, no, no. Not happening on my watch. Nice try, but no. Oh, no! Oh, damn, we gotta be careful about lowering our numbers. We're okay this time. But that wasn't in the bag yet. Yeah. Whew! Damn. Close match. The Cap Dwarf. Pretty good. Those diagonal things happening enable some new strategies. New card obtained. Zemzalet. Raise the power of allied cards on affected tiles by three while this card is in play. Interesting patterns. Goodness me. This makes you the one that got away. Are Serves you hitting me on right me? For looking <laughs> down on you just because you're young. Queen's blood is a lot like fishing, you know? Gotta be patient, wait for the right moment, then reel them in. Time it wrong, and you'll be watching your victory swim away. <sighs> Just look what happened to me. Guess I had a bigger catch on my hands than I thought. <sighs> I should have been more careful. I didn't even have a sword holder this time. There's no chair. We're just. <laughs> playing while he was fishing at the same time. I enjoy Queen's Blood because the games are pretty short. I'm thinking about something like the the board game back in Horizon Forbidden West. That one was a bigger investment. It felt like each game took longer, so whenever I lost, it was like, oh man, I gotta start from all over again. Ocean but this one, quiet. even if you lose, it's not a big Keep deal. Quiet. Hello? Can tell you that much. <laughs> an old... Hey, you guys are that avalanche splinter cell, right? Now, how the hell did you- I just gotta say, I'm a big, huge fan of yours. HQ wishes they could be as cool as you guys. <laughs> well, uh, we are pretty cool, but- <laughs> Think we could sit down for a chat later? Got a teensy favor to ask. And gotta thank you for before. Uh, I suppose you could come by the inn tomorrow? Sweet! You won't be sorry, promise. Later! Oh my gosh, she's doing the Naruto run. Um... I know, I know, she laid it on pretty thick. But hey, she's just a kid. What's the harm in hearing her out? Maybe she wants your autograph. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, let's get ourselves some rooms. Yeah, okay. We are pretty worn out for the day. Let's have some good... Rest. Hey, if it isn't the heroes of the hour, I heard about what you did for that girl. Thank you so much. Your stay is on us. We insist. It's the least we can do for you, really. Now then, how many we got? Will four rooms be enough? <laughs> uh, could you make it five? Five it is. Individual oh, rooms? Everything is comped. So, if you need anything at all, just ask. Don't know about you, but I'm dying to put my feet up. It's nice to have the place booked up again for once. Gosh, when was the last time that happened? Oh, so you can afford this because this doesn't happen often. It's nice to have the place booked up again for once. Individual rooms this time. Okay. Well, we can afford it, right? I 
could feel them slipping away one by one, and the tighter I held on, the more I lost. The memories? I, I felt the same. It was like they were sucking them straight out of my head. Who is that? Oh my god. And the worst part is that I don't even know what's missing. Only that something is. Like it's on the tip of my tongue, but I just can't remember. Damn whispers. Speaking of, you seen them lately? <laughs> hmm? Who's she Cloud. talking to? Who's in there with you? Oh. Hmm. Red. Oh! Thought it was someone else. Nope. All clear here, officer. Well, hope the rest of your patrol is just as uneventful. Hey, that... There was a purple chest in there. Come in. Thanks. Yeah, Red and Aerith... Even back in Remake, they seem to have some kind of a special rapport. What the hell was with Red's voice there? That was like... Yeah, they... Red knows a lot too. That he's not telling us. Empress's scepter! For you, my Empress, Aerith. No, not this Empress, the other one. Empress's scepter. Radiant ward. Finish off an enemy with a standard attack launched from within the ward. Yeah, materia for days. Materia slots. Do you have fire, Aerith? If you don't, you have fire and ice, never mind. You should probably have wind or something. Lightning? Lightning works. You get two of these lots. Weapon skills. Lightning damage up. Enduring ward. Max MP. MP recovery rate. Within the battle? Doesn't seem to... Hmm. Lightning... What happens if we inc increasing MP by three doesn't really do too much in the grand scheme of things, does it? It enables maybe like half a spell more. Okay. So that was weird. And we're not going to talk about it. Okay. I don't know about you, but it feels like we've been on the road forever. Like Midgar's ancient history. I wonder how Mom and Marlene are holding up. Homesick. Mm -mm. No time for that, not with Sephiroth around. Mm. So, a little random, but do you remember the first time we met? Yes. You shoved a flower in my face. It's called a gift, Cloud. I saw it, you know, in a vase at Seventh Heaven. And I seriously doubt you're the one who put it there. Hey, I mean... You never know. Some advice? Never re-gift a present from a girl. Ugh. Especially if you're just gonna give it to another one. Noted. Water under the bridge. But next time... Yeah, I, I don't know about that. <laughs> she had to find out about it too, that's the worst part. Where do you think those guys in black went? We should have seen them by now. Turks? Gotta wonder what Shinra's planning up there. Where do you think those guys in black went? Well, we should have seen them by now. We'll probably see them again sooner or later. Red. You're very cagey about everything. Yes. Hi, Red. Not as happy with me as with Aerith. Aerith is already a smiling face, but not you yet. This town reeks of fish and brine. Should Shinra come calling, I doubt I'll smell them till it's too late. We'll be fine. We'll manage. <laughs> it feels like I have fish bones in my nose. My poor nose. <laughs> <laughs> Do they know each other from before? Because Aerith... For a while was captured within the Shinra stuff, the labs and all that, right? And Red was there the whole time, so maybe they did know each other from before. Ha! 
hi. Oh. Hey. Perfect timing. I was just about to come find you. Yeah, I... <sighs> you... Can we talk? Regret what I said in calm. Oh. Come in. I should have never doubted you. It's fine. I never should have doubted you either. Say, do you remember a guy named Emilio from Nibelheim? Uh. That's way too cheesy. <laughs> the general store kid? Yeah. <sighs> anyway, he left the village right before you did. Thought I'd never see him again. Then one day last year, he shows up at 7th Heaven. I couldn't believe my eyes. He was all grown up. Didn't even recognize him at first. Really? Yeah, and what's more, the woman who walked in with him was stunning. Like, she could have been a model, and... <sighs> Where are you going with this? You're not interested, are you? Oh, no, 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 no! Not really. But uh, I'm happy to listen, so... No! Go ahead. Cloud! It's okay. Forget oh it. Oh my god, no! Was this another test? No! No, it wasn't. I... Cloud! <sighs> Why deny it? I guess it was, huh? I'm sorry. It's fine. We'll find time to talk. Just the two of us. Figure things out. Oh my god, that went s <sighs> Just be ready to spill your guts, huh? <laughs> With my iron stomach? Oh, <laughs> I, I guess they're doing better than before. Night. I don't know. Was that a test, though? It was more like they were just chilling out talking about the older times, right? And Cloud... We don't actually... Okay, when we, when we shoot the crap, we don't care about the contents of what we talk about, but we care about the person we're talking to. So you have to show your interest in that part, at least. Don't actually just say... I think I'll turn in early tonight. No! You ought to get some sleep, too. No! I think I'll turn in early tonight. But at least she's happy about me remembering Emilio or something. Uh, Barrett, where are you? I need... I need consolation. Where, where is Barrett? Did I miss him downstairs? Did I miss him downstairs? No, Barrett's on the... No? I thought the dot, the blue dot is... Oh, maybe that's a person downstairs or something. Wait, did I miss Barrett? Because that's my own room, right? That's not Barrett's room. Yeah. No. This is Barrett's room. No, it's my room. Where's Barrett? First room? It's open. Oh, I missed- it, he was right next to Aerith. I see. Hey. Hey, so about that Yuffie kid, what do you think she wants with us? Be honest. I guess. Maybe she wants to join Avalanche. Normally, I wouldn't turn anyone away, but she's just too young. Don't have the time or patience to babysit. I'll break it to her gentle. Kind of weird that that conversation would change our relationship, because... I mean, that's just my guess on what she wants. I don't know what she wants. 
Shinra didn't waste any time getting our names and faces out here, did they? No. Rest up while you can. I'll let you know if anything happens. Sounds good. Yeah, okay. Barrett missed all the drama with everybody else. This room is just nobody's. Apparently. Okay, I mean... I forgot about our little thing with Tifa already. Now they brought it up again and now I'm... Now I'm pissed again. <laughs> Damn it, Cloud! Ah. Yes. You feel all right? Good morning. <laughs> Shoes. Okay. Now that the gang's all here, it's time you got to know me. My name is Yuffie, Materia oh, Hunter doing this and again. Elite Ninja Operative <laughs> for the Interim Wutai Government. I left my beloved homeland behind to bring an end to Shinra's reign of terror and prove that Wutai's not to be trifled with. Wutai? Yep. Which brings me to that little favor I mentioned yesterday. Long story short, I want you to join me. HQ, they just didn't understand. But you guys get it. <sighs> Don't ninjas creep around in the dark slitting people's throats. I mean, we've done some shit, but we ain't about to stoop that low. I resent that. <laughs> Although, that is something we do. Yeah, we're not too into Wutai. That's why we're the Splinter Cell. Come here. Because the rest of them are into Wutai. Traveling alone so far from home is expensive. So I've been moving from town to town, hustling, scraping together enough scratch to keep sticking it to the man. Until, that is, I came here. And lucky I did, because I met Rhonda. She offered me the gig of a lifetime, an assassination. And guess who the target is? Seriously, guess! <sighs> Just spit it out already. Who else but a certain company's new president? Whoa! Rufus freaking Shinra! That crazy or what? That's a bit... And that douchebag will be here any minute now. Up there here anyway. Enjoying his fancy inauguration parade. These people had their country stolen from them, and then their sunlight. Junon demands revenge. So when the president steps out... <sighs> oh, wow. Tell us more. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You want to know how Rhonda's planning on paying me? With your bounty suckers. What? Interesting. Oh, her. The lady works fast. Well, this was fun. See ya. Hey! <laughs> It was too good to be true after all. I know you're in there, my friend. If you manage to get away, you should try to find Priscilla. She'll get you topside. <laughs> now, now, you don't want to make me come in there and fetch you because oh? I would love to do it. Who's that? Roach? <sighs> A pain in the ass. Let's go. Oh, no one else here has met him. Because we were doing that with Jesse before. Jesse and Biggs and Wedge. Ah, uh, it wasn't gonna be that simple, was it? Just pointing out that bounty and not taking it? Of course not. I don't have a motorcycle today. What do you want? My, my, aren't we a team? Yo, I don't swing that way. <laughs> Honestly, how long do you intend to keep me waiting? Maybe I'll just go out through the back. Are we sure that's not a thing? Really? Eh. 
Okay. Absence certainly makes the heart grow fonder, my friend. <laughs> Still playing hard to get, eh? Well, I've got news for you, young man. As if by fate, the speed demon has been entrusted with a singular task. Retrieving one Aerith Gainsborough. No. Uh, me? No. You come alone? <laughs> it only takes two to tango. Besides, you and I like to go big, and a venue this small just won't do. But no need to worry. I found the perfect stage. <laughs> the city above, where we can dance up a storm. Seek me out, and we'll put our last performance to shame. With a show none shall ever forget. <laughs> oh, jeez. You got some weird friends, man. Yeah. We might want to think about getting out of here. These people don't need more trouble. Yuffie said to talk to Priscilla if we wanted to get topside, right? Let's go find her. Thanks, Yuffie, for the quick warning. Hello, Rhonda. Thanks for dealing with that Shinra nut job. Don't you think for even a second we did that for you, the slime ball who sold us out? Take it. Not much, but it's yours. The hell's this supposed to be? Five thousand. <laughs> Your bounty. Part of it, anyway. Five thousand! You thought I'd put you through the ringer like that without making it worth your while? We're on the same side. Always have been. And what if Biker Boy had taken us in? Then I would have had to improvise. But I didn't, because it all worked out. Worked out fine. Like I pray it will for Yuffie upstairs. You need to tell us beforehand, before you do these kind of things. They paid you a bounty before we were even caught. That's actually kind of crazy. But I was gonna complain because our bounty was like 600k. You gave us 5,000. That's a big difference. 